Welcome everyone to WAW Aftermath. We are week two of the Apocalypse Tournament, Championship Tournament. You know what, I was gonna make an Amy Winehouse joke, but I mean, that's a joke in itself right there, so what else can I say, Mr. Bishop? How are you doing tonight? Of course, I'm greatness himself, Chad Epic. I, the only thing you can say at this point, Chaz, what would make me happy is take it to Pete. Take it to Pete. Hello, and welcome to WAW Aftermath. <laughs> and in matches this week, we part of the Pop Boats Championship Tournament preliminary round. Preliminary match one. Entry first from Norfolk, Virginia, the Eagle of Chester, Stacey Rowe! <laughs> Oh God. Well, I think we finally have hit California, Mr. Epic, because it's hot out, and now thanks to Sage, we're having an earthquake. Uh. Hey Chaz, what time is it? My watch isn't working. Well, I'll tell you what time it is. It's time for Sage to get a beat down by this man, the King of Violence, Rocco! You say he's gonna get a beat down, but I don't know if all our fans have my book or face space or anything face like a tweeter or anything like that. Tweeter? Yeah, you never you don't have any of those? Oh, Watch okay. the match, Chaz. But the fact is, Rocco last week drop kicks to Lena Carlina in the knee and screwed her up pretty bad. Yeah. And all week he's been tracking her down, trying to get an apology. He said he feels bad. The king of violence feels Rocco. bad. We're talking about the same Rocco, right? I Rocco. know it's hot out, but I, I, I don't know if he's turned into mush or what. But I, yes, the same exact Rocco. Well, it would be Beauty and the Beast because Rocco only loves one thing, and that is beating the hell out of people. And speaking of which, here we go. I completely agree with you, but the fact of the matter is, all he's been doing is trying on Facebook, on MySpace, all of those. He still has a MySpace. All kidding aside, he still has one. And, and oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh. Beauty of the mush. Come but on. he's trying to get her to, uh, 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 trying to get her to apology, accept his apology. Well, considering that Stelina Cardinale slapped PC Fresh in the face for incoming oh. for trying to get her phone number, I'm pretty sure Rocco is uh You're he's the king of Oh no. It's, well hey, he may Rocco. not have a chance with her, but here it comes start. Well, oh! Wait a minute! Hip toss into the ring. Into not just the ring, but just the metal barricade that support holds the wrestling ring up. And Rocco's got to get up. I mean, you know what? The guy lives and thrives off hurting people and violence. I tried to talk some sense into him. It's like trying to friggin' bleed blood out of a turnip. It just doesn't happen. Well, if this keeps up, I think Sage is going to be the one who's bleeding. However, Rocco on the disadvantage, off the ropes. Big clothesline. You God. were saying? Knocks him out of his boots. Of course, Sage, you know, he's like, this is like a handicap match. Sage is worth two people. Oh. You can make all the jokes you want, but Sage Dorello is the WAW juggernaut. All right, it's going to take a lot no, more. No, he's the jiggle knot. That's what he does. That was probably your worst pun. Sidewalk slam. This could be it. One, two. That Rocco was pretty good, actually. Out at that two. No, no, it was not good. <laughs> the fact of the matter is here, Sage Zarello, no matter, you can make fun of his size or not, always oh. will and can't pumpkin crush a... Yeah, yeah, pay attention, Chaz. Rocco can the van. One, two. Nope. Sage Zarello, the mammoth of a man that he is, has probably a couple hundred pounds on Rocco, whose mind is elsewhere, who needs to focus on this match. Well, I'm not going to argue that point. Rocco does seem to be a little distracted. However, oh. that's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. Well, that was a little shades of Gino Diomedes with a flipping neck breaker. Focus on the match, Rocco. All right, and here we go. This could be it. Off the ropes. Kick to the head. 
Yeah, See this, it. this is very much unlike Rock. Headbutt, that's what I'm talking about, the walking juggernaut of WAW. The Eagle of Justice right there. Well, the Eagle of Justice got, just got his wings clipped. Both men down, Red Guy on the count. God damn, I am unbuttoning this top button for once in okay. WAW. I'm not bringing the heat. All right, I'm moving over because I don't want to know what you're on. It's okay, I'm wearing the singlet. Oh, God, even worse. All right, both men struggling to get to their feet. Sage up first. a little bit. Uh, all right, enough. We don't care about what your underwear, Chaz. It's not underwear. It's daily attire. Big right. Another one. Back followed in. by a back and forth. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Sage saying there's moops? Oh, oh wow. Slingshot, excuse me, snap suplex into the corner. And Rocco could be out. This could be it. Sage gets it. You're right. Sage gets that mass moving. Oh, dear. Yoko Zuna heading to the ropes. And big splash. Wait a minute. He's out? What? Oh. Major <laughs> Morpheus <laughs> Morenci. <laughs> Yeah. Think about the retaliation for last week with Saber. Oh, I, I, I'm and Saber, and I'm getting popcorn, Chaz. This is going to be fun. I want some? No. Oh. Get, get your own. Come on, move, touch me. Hit me, move. Sage Zarello, so he can hit him. He's in no man's land. It wouldn't really matter. This is intense. Intense nothing. The robot's Major process. Of course it's intense. The robot's processing what's going on. Processing Saint nothing. Zarello needs to focus on the match, though, because he could have had this one with that huge splash. And now, oh, wait a minute. Slingshot. Hang on. It could be again. No, no Rocco. Wait, oh, Rocco gets out and... Oh, oh to the rope. Pumped and crushed. And one, two, three. That is it. And without laying a hand <laughs> on it. Well, we were talking about Rocco not having his head in the game, but thanks to Morpheus Morenci, it is Saint Zorro whose head gets screwed with, and Rocco picks up the win! Keep your mind on... You call it winning, but keep it focused. All right, Andy, we are... Oh, no. Who gave him a mic? Hey, that was clearly a setup. I should be a dance man. Fuck with the tournament. Oh, wah, wah, wah. Shut up. No, no, no. Actually, it's going to be just the opposite. You see, Moose, you screwed me for the last time. Tonight... I want my match with Garbo. What? I deserve it. Oh, come on. Who took me out of Annihilation? That was not my choice. I should have been on that winning Annihilation team. I should have been fighting Garbo. Oh. So tonight, I demand that match. What? And you know what? I'm going to sit right here until I get it. And I'm going to tell you people... Oh, God, come on. So if there's any sort of official out there that can grab this and stop Well, I don't know how official she is, but she's the president. You don't get much more official than Acting that. Acting president. Acting. Hang on, Chaz. I got to get some ones out of my pocket. Look, I, I, I think I told everybody, it's too hot, I don't want to be bothered. Listen, I want my match, and I'm going to stand no, here nobody in this ring, the and I will tell like, every story about my childhood. I will talk about the time that me and Captain, we were little tots, and we were wrestling in our back living room. And I slammed that sidewalk. Enough. You don't care. Like I said, I in the office downstairs she with does. a strawberry daiquiri and a sexy group of dudes waiting to fan me. So let's move this along. Not a whore. I Sage, I'm, I'm not, not giving you anything. Get out. I'm not leaving this ring. So as I was saying, that night 
<sighs> me, when my mom got home, she was pissed. Okay, and she fine. beat me like a redheaded fine. child. Fine. Uh, Sage. You are a redheaded child. Let's move this along. The fourth wall. You, you got it. You got it. Fine. Sage gets his shot at the WW Championship on the hottest night of the year after he already fought Rocco. You will get it tonight. That is fine. Oh, come on. Hey, hey. Move some bottle light and come out here. Sage, get out. I'm the boss. I'm the boss. What am I doing? I'm not leaving. Oh, yes, you are. Are you going to throw me out? Do you want to go ahead, Moody? Show up, guys. If you want to stand here, you're going to have to go get me water because I'm getting a little bit parched. And quite honestly, the smell coming off of you or in the audience is making me a little sick. I'm to get a little bit heat sick. Step over here. Moody, you. Make me sick. Well, we got our main event then tonight. It's going to be Troy Garbo. Get out of here! Don't you yell at me! It's going to be Troy Garbo. God damn it! Can't get a word in edgewise. Moving on to more important issues. For one, my book, Shining Star, how I made it as a queen of WAW. We'll be releasing on August 27 for your purchasing pleasure. Yeah. I got an advanced copy. But, oh, big news. Some changes in the, in the Apocalypse Tournament. One of our winners, Laura, is unable to attend this week. Oh, we got a little hole there. Got a little problem. So, therefore, tonight, we'll be having a last chance battle royale. Where the winner will fight one of our other winners, Bianca Wild, to see who gets next. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is hand it over to Pete, because like I said, I make a lot of money. I don't get paid to work in this kind of weather. Take it away, Pete. Do you work? Well, Miss Star, I guess. Can I talk I'll, now? Uh, well, I was going to say, thank God she got rid of Sage, but setting up a battle royal for the next yeah, match? This will be a last chance battle royal. I like it. Where the commander is going to be, main part of the body touches the floor or the mats around the ring. Entry first, Burlington, Vermont. Serena Renzi! I'm surprised she can still walk after Sage whooped her so bad last week. I'm surprised she can still walk being close to Sage. Being next to him is like breathing bad bacon. However, Serena Marinci now ready to roll in this battle royale. Andrew Sicker from El Mexico. It's Santos Del Grande, and that's the battle royal. Six, six, six. All right, wait a minute. These guys are a team. Yes, very good. Yeah, but how is, is this supposed to be a battle royal? And not kindergarten. All right, whatever. I guess I can call them the two amigos. And third, from Juggalo Land, it's Hex. Juggalo Land, from New Inn, Massachusetts. All right, so it's like Juggalo Land next to Dudleyville, or where is it? It's actually adjacent from Parks Unknown. Ah, okay. Well, the excellence of execution set himself up here. Huh. To get his shot. I thought the other two were weird. I hate Juggalos. Hate them. Hate them. That's for It's Ecuador! Ecuador! Oh boy. We are scraping the bottom of the barrel tonight for this match, folks. Chaz, do you know? Ecuador! Ecuador. Yeah, we, we got it. You know what this guy's middle name is? What's his middle name, Chaz? Jonathan. What's his last name? Ecuador. EJE. 
and Salini Kamali. Speak of the she devil. Rocco's little lady love, or at least the object of his affection. And limping a little bit. Good God. Yeah. Now, what's she doing, though, in this match? Isn't she injured? No. It's the heart of a Sicilian right there going out to the ring and putting up with an injury. But right now is the Battle Royal. Let me explain the rules of a WAW Battle Royal. You must get thrown outside the ring. Any part of you, even the smallest bit of hair, as we saw at the 2011 Lord of the Ring, touches the bottom of the floor. You're eliminated. There goes Sex Face uh, up and over. Uh, no, unfortunately, well, Stelina gets the first elimination. With an injured leg and all that. There we go, see? Yeah, because Hex did the oh, wait. work. Oh, it up! Oh. Oh. Ecuador up and over, thrown out by the Germans. Thanks to St Serena, and now Nachos. Uh, the, Amer the only American in the ring is a friggin' juggalo. You know how upsetting that makes me? Well, wait a minute, what's Serena? She's German. Oh. You realize her last name is Merrick before she got married to Major Morpheus Morenzi, right? I don't t And pay speaking attention of the American, there he goes. Out goes Hex. Wow. Nachos this now is down the as well. This battle royal I've ever seen, and we're down to two. Well, at least we got two women going at it. That's beautiful. Yeah, thing I right there. appreciate that. But Stelina at the disadvantage, however, still got at least six inches on Serena. However, Serena, a little more experience, and of course, Serena, a perennial, a perennial on you. rival of Bianca Wild, and it going in the ring against her doesn't teach you a few things. Oh, there we go. Well. Whoa, wait a minute. Rocco. Uh, what? Go down. No. What is Rocco doing? Go out here? downstairs. What is Rocco doing out here? What? This is what I'm talking about. I came out here to apologize once again. What? I am sorry. I thought you were. Rocco. What? Wait a minute. Rocco. Rocco costing Stelina the match. You're a winner. Stelina Marinci. This oh dear. is a Hall of Famer. Oh! What are you doing? This is what I mean. He's going friggin' and now he's trying to help it in the back. Rocco! This is not the caveman days! The heck? He's been hanging around Carnage way too much. Well, you know what? I'm sorry, but here's the thing. Serena Mer uh, excuse me, Serena Morenci now has a second chance to fight Bianca Wild tonight. Oh dear. For a second chance at the Apocalypse Tournament. She got double duty too as well, Sage. 